right then. This is a real serious video. Like 100% totally serious. These goddamn YouTubers. This goddamn revenue. These goddamn Minecraft Let's Play videos. Even though I make them myself, you know. On original pieces of shit. So it seems to me, yeah, that there seems to be some sort of YouTube gang war going on. Like, you got the fucking Tupac, PewDiePie, Markiplier, and Jacksepticeye side. And then you got the fucking Biggie Small side, which is just like all these fucking edgy teenagers who are just like the leafiest here, pyrocynical, uh, some Russian dude, I don't know. And uh, the problem with this, yeah. Is that you start to think, well, fuck, what kind of community am I going to build up on my channel? Because you're either going to get the Tupac side, which is all, like, support and, you know, pretty much positive feedback. Except, you obviously, you do get your negative feedback, but it's not, it's not really that bad. And then you've got the Biggie Smalls fucking side, which is, you know, the Leafy is here and Pyrocynical and, the, and that one Russian dude. And with that side, it's more or less like, you just expect to get insulted, so do you want the community what's well, definitely going to insult the fuck out of you the minute you put a video up, but also like you because they're edgy? Or do you want the community that's going to be like, yes, we love it so much, and <laughs> don't even know what the fuck that was supposed to be. But I know there's negativity on both sides, but it's just like different types of negativity. Like, again, Tupac side, you've got like, uh, I love how I'm using fucking gangster rappers to uh, demonstrate my point on, you, on YouTube when like pretty much, let's face it, the majority of YouTube videos are made to entertain kids, even though we do pretend we're entertaining adults. But let's be honest, most of the community, when you get a big community, is pretty much school kids. Um, oh yeah, back to the point. <laughs> See, the two-part side, you know, you're going to get support constantly, but with that community, you also get the problem of having, like, fans which will support you, but also, like, seem to keyboard warrior fight to the death for you as well, over really silly topics, which, you know, fucking kicks off YouTube drama. And then you've got the fucking, again, the biggie small side, and it's all, you just, you just can't even... You can't even post a fucking comment, to be fair, because the minute you put a comment down, it's like, KYS, KYS, fucking drink some Clorox bleach. Uh, the actual fuck. It doesn't seem like people are real. It just seems like there's two types of fucking robots on a website, and they're both typing either fucking constant spam of kill yourself or constant spam of we love you. Uh, <laughs> what are you even supposed to do with that? I mean, you know how an edgy teenager comes across to me? A fucking edgy teenager comes across to me as a hipster nowadays. A fucking hipster. I mean, let's be honest, that's pretty much what an edgy teenager is. It's just someone who's just fucking jumping on the bandwagon and just doing whatever the fuck they get told by the person who's apparently dark humoured. And it, uh, I just find it kind of fucking stupid because at the end of the day, it, <laughs> how do you think I come across? across like hipsters when i first see hipsters i think of them as fucking dicks you know how i come across dicks through the amigle chat camera not the fucking youtubers community I and mean, this is 